We're going to keep it current going into this weather cast, and this was just in the last hour. Finally, the clouds lifting a bit. Looks like there's still some kind of shower activity moving through. A chance of isolated snow showers lingers into this evening forecast, but we will see some clearing, so we have a chance to see some better sunsets uh, into the weekend. This was a brilliant Susitna sunset. Thank you to Gregory Booth. You could see some of the downtown buildings highlighted there in the foreground. I just love those colors. And now we got to talk about the big thing that happened today. It was more snow for the Anchorage area, about a half an inch. So 132.6 inches now. We are tied for second place. In 1945, or excuse me, 1954 and 1955, 132.6. And so far this year, we are at 132.6. So under two inches needed to break that all-time snowfall record. However, less precipitation heading our way going into this evening as well as the next couple of days. It's 40 now from the airport. That would make it our warmest temperature so far through the day. 40 from the south end of town to Jay Bear and 42 right now at the Campbell Creek Science Center. Checking out south central Alaska, the precipitation, most of it going to the Anchorage area. These are liquid equivalents, not necessarily snowfall amounts, but you can see it was on the light side for most of the state. On Alaska, seeing some rain fall uh, about a third of an inch in Yakutat, as well as Sitka as well. That's a result of that storm system that continues to push off to the east. Snowfall lingering into the interior. They'll see some clearing too. And on the back side of that system, as it continues to work its way to the east, some colder air will be surging in on the back side of that system, and that will cool things off, especially for parts of the northern coast and interior. Still through the next hour, there are ongoing blizzard warnings and winter weather advisories. The winds have been pretty strong over the last several days. We're again today. They'll stay strong through the evening, although those should expire here within this hour. Then we go to winter weather advisories along the Arctic slope that will go through uh, at least Friday night into Saturday morning in the same case for the winter storm warning to the eastern coast of the Beaufort Sea. South Central, clouds breaking up a bit here into the afternoon. There's some snow showers kind of hugging the spine of the Kenai Peninsula and uh, right on into the Susitna Matanuska Valley area and Prince William Sound. This circulation, though, continues to move off to the east. Uh, it's going to still ensnare the north Gulf Coast and Panhandle as we go through the weekend. But we'll, in the south central region and even parts of the interior, see some clearing skies. And that's as a result of a small ridge of high pressure that presses in. And uh, that gives us a pretty nice weekend coming our way before this next round of very active spring weather moves in on the west end of the Aleutians. Here's our forecast heading into Saturday. Sunshine spreading across the, the Aleutian chain as and uh, then there's that snow rain mix for the southeastern panhandle high temperatures will also stay into the 40s it will be mostly rain although you could see some snow mixing in we're back to some sunshine in the kenai peninsula high temperatures right around 40 degrees for most locations still looking at some isolated snow showers rain showers in prince william sound but a lot of the region is going to see some very nice weather as we head into the weekend highs up to 41 here in Anchorage and they stay into the forecast over the seven day forecast period. Look at that mostly sunny again on Monday into Tuesday as well. It looks like we're going to have a nice weekend. Rebecca? Absolutely. Thank you, Jackie.